yo, yo, what's up? This your boy XV coming through with another episode of the X Vision Files. And in this episode right here, I got a good one for y'all, man. I got a real thought-provoking one right here, man. You know, sometimes we got to go back in the past and revisit stories. You feel me? Because sometimes it just don't make no sense. And in this one, we're going we gonna to jump in the time machine and we're going to talk about um, Kevin Hart. Is he a clone? Or is it just conspiracy? And, you know, I ran across this video last night and I was just thinking like, hmm, you know, it's very interesting to, you know, rehatch and reopen that 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 case because that was really funny on, you know, the surroundings of that car accident that he got into and, you know, some of the things that, this um YouTube creator right here is about to explain. Shouts out to um Call Me Ken Folk. That's the name of the um content creator. Call me Ken Folk. Y'all subscribe to him. Um this is the content. We're gonna be watching his content and he for the breakdown, you know, the ins and outs of, you know, Kevin Hart being a clone. You know, so we're gonna hear this brother out. And without further ado, man, let's let's get into it. Kevin Hart's terrifying car crash back in September of 2019. TMZ reports that no one in the car that night has filed a lawsuit or been sued. On September 1st, Hart was a passenger in his 1970 Plymouth Barracuda when the driver of the car, Hart's friend and producer Jared Black, lost control and crashed through some wooden fencing. It was just before 1 a.m. in Malibu, California. The blue Barracuda crashed about 10 feet off the road and into a ditch, leaving both men with major back injuries and landing Hart in the operating room for spinal surgery. He recently opened up about the aftermath of that crash in an interview with Men's Health, explaining that his recovery process has led him to do better and prioritize his family even more, which his wife, Aniko Parrish, is happy about. She tells Men's Health, quote, there were times where he was here, but not really here. Not to say he wasn't a family man before, but he's expressed that the accident made him make up for some of the time missed because of work. Meanwhile, Hart went on to add, I'm not trying to get back to where I was before. I want to do better than before. It's a resurrection. Resurrection. That's the best way for me to put it. I feel like the other... Hey, they always use... See, y'all got to understand, words are spells, man. Words are spells, man. Y'all got to really... Especially dealing with Hollywood, social media, and, and, and stuff like that. Words are spells, man. You got you to gotta, you gotta be careful, and you got to be very observant on the words that these people use. Resurrection, you know, if you don't know what resurrection is, you know, go look it up, you know what I'm saying? But it's to revive, it's like a, a new, you know, so someone's, you know, you know the, the, the old person's gone and, and it's something anew. You feel what I'm saying? You're being resurrected, you know what I'm saying? Like, you be, you know, so, um, yeah, man. So yeah, we gotta watch the words that they that, that they use and stuff, man. You know, let's let's continue. Another version of myself died in that moment, and this new version was born to understand and to do better. I'm glad. He said, I feel like the other version of myself died in that moment, and this new version was born to understand and to do better. I'm glad this is coming now. I'm getting old. I'm 40. You know this is when I'm supposed to start realizing this. This is crazy. Now he, now he said, um, he said, um, I feel like the other version of myself died in that moment. And this new version was born. That is crazy. You see what I'm saying? Y'all got to watch words, man. So you see so you thinking like, oh, he talking about, you know, you, you know, something something philosophical or something like that. Nah, he nah, he literally feel like that. You feel me? So, yeah, man. You gotta watch the words. Glad this is coming now. I'm getting older. I'm 40. You know, this is when I'm supposed to start realizing this bleep. I'm coming, guys. Don't worry. These are the emergency calls made moments after Kevin Hart's vintage muscle car careened off an LA road. The caller describing the chaotic scene early Sunday morning. Sounds like the passenger's stuck in the car. Uh, the driver is out of the car, so yeah, he looks a little hurt. Uh, I think the 
top of the car is crushed. But today there is new confusion about who was behind the wheel. How many people are stuck inside, do you know? I think it's just one lady out. Uh, the driver is out right now. They're trying to get the passenger out. The bystander saying he saw the driver get out of the car. But the initial report says Hart's friend, Jared Black, was in the driver's seat and trapped in the vehicle when emergency crews arrived. Police say Black's fiance, fitness trainer Rebecca Broxterman, was also unable to get out of the car. In the newly released calls, an unidentified male voice can also be heard speaking in the background. But police did not say any of the passengers were taken to the hospital on their own, indicating only Hart left the scene to his nearby residence to get medical attention. The initial police report also saying alcohol was not a factor in the crash. At 2.15 a.m., a woman identifying herself as Hart's wife called 911 from their home. He was in a car accident earlier tonight, or what happened? Yes, earlier tonight. I don't know what happened. He's not coherent at all. Did he get treatment originally from when he was injured? Did he go to the hospital or? No, 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 no treatment at all. Did he get treatment originally from when he was injured? Did he go to the hospital? She sound very calm. She sound very calm and collected. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, already something ain't right. Or medical attention. We're just here. My apologies, y'all. My bad. He can't move. Is there any uh, obvious broken bones that you can tell? you see anything broken? Just something on his back is pulling out on his side. Hart is expected to make a full recovery after undergoing back surgery. But four days after the accident, police sources familiar with the matter tell NBC News the investigation remains ongoing after a late night ride involving one of Hollywood's biggest stars. They're, they're clones, stupid just ass. Like Damn, they look just like you. It's the same exact person. Let me Even say. down to the DNA. You know what DNA is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you sure? DNA is digital necessary asset. I always thought it was that. Now, what I need to know is we're going to break up into two groups. Who wants to be... Dog, you, you see what he just said? He said DNA, digital necessary asset. So that's what a clone is created for. It's a digital copy of the real one, and it's a necessary asset because Kevin Hart make make man he be he make a lot of money for the for for the for the for the for the upper ups. We'll just say that <laughs> he make a lot of money. You know he make a lot of money in the Matrix, and you know if I got you know thinking think thinking through an evil science scientist mind, I'll be like you know what. If, I could, if I'm able to clone somebody and just put them out there and make money off this clone and the real the real one is dead, why not? You know what I'm saying? What's stopping, what's stopping me? You feel me? So we got to think like that too. Like, you know what I'm saying? You, you can't be ration. You, you can't be rational with the unrational. You feel what I'm saying? You cannot be rational with the unrational. You feel me? So... Like I said, they, they, they got underground facilities. They got all types of stuff, man. Our tax dollars go to a lot of programs that we don't know about, bro. You feel what I'm saying? So uh, all that, oh, well, well, that's impossible. And, 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 and oh, that's conspiracy theory. And that, that that's fake. And, man, that's out the window, man. They can do whatever they want, basically. You feel me? And that's crazy because, you know, looking at looking at this now, it's like, was is that the clone right there? You feel what I'm saying? That's talking. That's crazy, man. And now they got an episode on this. Um, I think I think this episode. I think this um Hollywood, um, husbands of whatever husbands of Hollywood, whatever that shit called. You know what I'm saying? My bad, y'all. My bad. I'm excuse. My bad. I forgot to put my shit on. Um, not disturb. Do not disturb. But anyway, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's it's just crazy, man. Like. You know, okay, all right, I see the name right there, Real Husbands of Hollywood. My bad, I, I wasn't reading that right there, but yeah. This is the Real Husbands of Hollywood, and so you mean to tell me that's a clone on the set? 
You feel me? That's the clone talking right there. Down with the Kill Kevin clone group. All right, wait. I've been dreaming about killing Kevin for years. Do you know how many hits I have if I kill Kevin on my single fans? Then Akira will be all mine. This nigga got to die. He's everywhere else in Sports SportsCenter. Kevin Hart, star of the new film Central Intelligence, joining us now. Uh, how, how do you do it? Every I look on Twitter. There you are. Facebook. There you are. Television. There you are. How do you do it? I have a clone. I, I was I was going to say that. There's two of you. Cats out the bag. Okay? It's about good. I'm telling you. You see that, man? That man. Now, everybody would think this man is playing. Like, this is this this aired for real. This is real. This ain't no skit. This ain't none of that. Like he he went on um um Sports Center, and they was interviewing him about um I think he was doing a movie called Central Intelligence, you know, and they was interviewing him and he asked him that question and he flat out just said right that right there, he flat out said it. Yeah, they, I got a clone. That's the first words he said. Three of me, uh, you know, we broke it. They didn't want to release it yet. This is major news that I'm giving you. All right. I'm the first person to ever use it. I'm cloned. Okay, all right. I appreciate That's it. why I'm able to do all that I do. All right. Uh, movie coming out this weekend. What was it like uh, working with The Rock? I have a clone. I have a clone. I have a clone. I'm telling you, man, bruh, I'm telling you, this ain't no game, bruh. And I remember this back when, I remember my, my, my sister point, appointed me to this right here. I was like, she was like, yeah, he said, because I was like, what? And then I went and researched it, and then I remember it was back then. I was like, dang, he did say, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I said I wanted to go back and revisit this story, because when I ran into this guy content, like I say, shots, shots out again to call me kinfolk. This is this is the content we watching. And um, yeah, man, like I ran across his video and I'm like, wait a minute, man. I need to do a reaction video. You know what I'm saying? A, a pointing to this story because it was very funny how the reports didn't match up and all this and and then all of a sudden he, oh I'm being resurrected and all this like it, it, it like, and like I said dealing with Hollywood and dealing with the industry man bruh it's very demonic man so it, it, it is not far fetched at all at all I, I was I was gonna say that there's two of you cats out the bag okay it's about a good three of me uh you know we broke it they didn't want to release it yet this is major news that i'm giving you all right i'm the first person to ever use it i'm cloned i'm cloned i'm cloned he said i'm the first person that ever use it i doubt that my friend you is not the first person trust me you know you is not the first person if, if you've been cloned it's been plenty of people before you that been cloned trust me okay all right. that's, why I that's why i'm able to do all that i do Ooh, what it do? I can my fam. Welcome back. You need some to come give us a look. Now, today, as you can see, we have Kevin Hart is no longer here. The Kevin Hart that you see is a clone. So without further ado, man, we finna tap in. We finna see what's going on. Kevin Hart, dead and clone. All right. Once again, shouts out to Call Me Ken Folk, man, with the good content, man. Y'all subscribe to that boy, man. Um, I looked in his archives and he got good work, man. He really trying to he keep really trying to wake the people up. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I like I like content creators like that that's trying to wake the people up. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, man. Shouts out to that boy. Y'all go subscribe to that boy. Call me Ken Folk. So y'all have seen the videos prior to, you know, me opening up this video. Y'all heard the details that don't make sense. But it's a reason why they give you these details that don't add up. It's always something missing in these stories. But that's for a reason. They want you to know that something's off about this. If you use your critical thinking skills, then you'll see 